So today I'm going to do, I'm not sure what I'm going to call it, like a Manny chat or chit chat and Manny or manicure chat. Anyways, but I just thought we, instead of getting ready, we'll do our nails together today. So I have a Color Club nail polish in the color Favorite Flannel. Then I have a Mega, Wet n Wild Mega Last in the color I'm Not Shrimpy. So let's, and I already did my um, base coat and did nail prep. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So I'm going to do one coat of the Color Club. And I'm going to do kind of like an accent nail. Some of my nails are shorter than others because I don't really care if they're all different lengths. I mean, obviously if it's super extra extreme, I'll just completely start all the way over. But I just am not today, I guess. So right now what you're seeing on this camera is the vlogging camera and then the one right here is um, a regular filming camera. And I don't have that many lights, so I'm only using the lights I normally use. So with my nails, there's a lot of shadow. And that's awesome. Not really, I hate that. But I'm kind of working with what I got right now. When I used to film in my other filming area before I moved, I had a lot more natural lighting, and that helped a lot. But um, I don't have that much natural lighting anymore okay so I changed the angle of this camera and it's not as much shadow so I did one coat of the color club I'm gonna let that dry but while we're letting that dry I'm gonna do the one with the mega last for the accent nail and this is what I would call my next video coming up after this one is either a nail another nail video or a um declutter for single shadows. I haven't decided yet. Depending on which one can get done quicker. Um, so I'm going to let these dry. So I'm going to go back in with a second coat of the Color Club. Color Club. I like, when I first got this nail polish, I came in a Wantable box. Um, I was like, oh, I don't know if I really like this color. But now that fall is approaching, I feel like this is a very good um, transition shade for fall and summer. That's what my next nail polish video is going to be. It's like transition summer fall nail polishes. Oh, it was kind of a thick coat, but oh well, kind of saves me. Especially if I have any dark spots, just kind of do a thicker coat, I guess. It takes longer to dry, though. That's probably the downfall with thicker coats. This is a kind of a thicker nail polish, so it kind of makes it easy. This could be a one coater, but I'm always one to do, no matter what kind of polish it is, I always do multiple coats. Like if it's a one coater nail polish, I will do two coats. I don't know. I'm just kind of OCD like that, I guess. Now I'm going to go back in with the Mega Last. Kind of like this, uh, kind of like a variation of a nail polish of a manicure that I did. I posted on Instagram. Um, but this one is a, it's not as dark. It's more of a berry tone instead of... I don't know. That one was a different color. So, those are the nails. I'm going to do a third coat on this finger and then we can go from there. And then I have my cleanup brush. I have found using this Eco Tools um, angled eyeliner brush is a lot better than that e.l.f. one because this one hasn't deteriorated in the slightest. It just still stays the same. So 
I think it's just like the, the better synthetic bristles that are a little bit um, better for cleanup. And then I just use, this is a um, acetone mixed with a strengthening nail polish remover. It's, I, it's not necessary to use a strengthening nail polish remover. That's just the one I had on hand and I always have acetone. So I just put it in this Febreze little pump that I finished up the Febreze in and then I just pump it to the top here and just dip from here. And then I have a little tissue for dabbing. So I'm going to go and do another coat of the Megalast. So I've applied a third coat to this nail, fixed this nail in the process. You can see there's kind of a little dab. I fixed this nail in the process of it. And yes, um, I'm getting, getting ready to add my quick dry top coat. This is from Pro FX. It is one of my favorites. It's from um, Walmart. And you can't really go wrong with it. Holy cannoli macaroni. Quick dry top coat. And it really is high gloss. Like, pretty high gloss. High gloss. But before I add that, we're going to go ahead and do some cleanup with my handy dandy, handy dandy cleanup brush. Just kind of go around it. I mean, everybody kind of does it their own way, but I just kind of like to make it look like there's not a lot of product by the cuticle. And for some reason on this nail, I just have like higher skin or something. So I have to kind of really clean up right here. All right. There, by the cuticle. Let me get it there. This mixture really makes it easier because um, it doesn't really dry anything out because it's not pure acetone. And um, it makes it easier to clean up because it has a little more acetone than just a typical remover would. So I kind of like mixing my own because. Um, I don't like to use just pure acetone because it is really drying. So, I have a stomach cake. So, I'm going to clean off my brush. Almost like I'm using acrylic, but I just, just kind of flex it back and forth so that it doesn't stay stiff from the acetone because acetone can stiffen it. So after we've done that, our nails have dried. So now we can add our quick dry top coat. I really um, thought this would be really fun, kind of because everyone's doing like get ready with me's. So let's just do our nails together. That's fun, right? Super fun. Super extra fun. And when, as I do more of these kind of videos, I'll have better setups. Because this is kind of like trial and error as you go and you learn. Sometimes I do like to do a little bit of a thicker top coat because I feel like it adds more of depth to the shine. Because I'm just so technical that way. And... I'm really into this color. I've never worn it before. It's color club. I'm thinking that I'm going to continue to do these videos. I love the idea of them. So you ladies let me know what you think about this if you like it. And yeah. I would like to have girls nights where I can have this. But I can't. So I'm going to just try to improvise with videos. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like this video go ahead and please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. So you don't miss any more videos like this. And the next video that will be up will be another nail polish video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And you guys have a great one. Bye.